Okay guys, so my Apple Watch keeps changing my life and I do not know if it's for the worse or for the better. And if you're wondering at all what I'm talking about, take a look at this. Apple focuses on innovation. The product is meant to be practical, adopted, and lead to a change in the customer's everyday life. And the Apple Watch SE I have doesn't shy away from that. It is the first smartwatch I'd ever own, but it will be the last one I ever use. The Apple Watch was designed to complement the phone and add new functions to the phone, but also on top of that, free people from their phones. That last part of me being freed from it did make the cut. Don't get me wrong. I mean, the Apple Watch did help me out with my life a lot. Losing weight and working out at the gym became much more easier knowing I had the ability to track my progress and see where I was at in my journey. The silicon band also prevented rashes, which was an added plus. I could also see and respond to messages at work with a lot more quickness than my phone, especially if my hands were tied being wrapped up in a project. One of the most significant features was tracking my iPhone if I'd ever lost it. I can be quite forgetful sometimes and it's possibly because of my ADHD. So it was really great to know that if I ever did lose my phone, I could always find it with just a ping. But if there's one thing you guys should know about me, it's that I am a big fan of social media and technology detoxes. I think the time spent on certain devices can invoke or inflict stress, unproductivity, and even worse, sleep quality. The notification thing became a really big problem for me. As said before by many people who have told me, you can you know, go into your Apple settings and choose which of the notifications you want to come up on the Apple Watch. That didn't really work out for me because I found myself looking at my Apple Watch all the time to go ahead and just literally check notifications, almost like a phantom. Sometimes I didn't even have my Apple Watch and I'd find myself basically like doing this like all the time. And I think the reason why is because I'm so used to having the Apple Watch there and looking at it that it almost becomes secondhand nature. Looking for notifications, I go down this wormhole once again where, you know, I try to go ahead and text somebody on my phone, look up notifications uh, that come to me from emails, you know, um, things that come up from Instagram. It makes me more enticed to pick up my phone. And not only that, I go down this whole entire wormhole again on the iPhone. And personally for me, I just didn't like that. It's the charging. So I know for a fact that personally, um, I liked the original earphones. I really did like AirPods in the beginning, but I noticed that I always had to keep charging them over and over and over again. And that became really, really, really just tiresome. Personally for me, I just don't like that. I have to go ahead and keep charging this Apple Watch. Definitely does kind of affect my day. I mean, it doesn't affect my day greatly, but would it be kind of cool for me not to charge this watch and just keep going on my life compared to a regular watch? Yeah, of course. Ultimately, I'm a very minimalist and simplistic individual. I don't have to be connected 24 seven. It brings actual value and gratitude into my life when something isn't in arm's reach to me all the time. Too much devotion to technology does tend to steal that precious time towards the most beautiful moments in life, such as our family, friends, and even nature. As Bruce Lee once said, It is like a finger pointing away to the moon. Don't concentrate on the finger or you will miss all that heavenly glory. As for now, I'm probably gonna go back to my fossil watch. The mechanical watches seem far more interesting to me personally and definitely have a very selective different amount of taste compared to the regular automatic thing that is the Apple Watch. I wanna know some of your guys' opinions. How has the smartwatch affected your life? And uh, if you really like the video, just go ahead and like it. Don't forget to comment. Tell me what you think. You know, that's really gonna help out the YouTube algorithm and definitely give me a feeling of what I can possibly do for the next video. Until then guys, I really appreciate you watching and you guys have a great day. Bye.